Alright, so hi guys, in this video I'm going to show you right now how to jailbreak your 32-bit iDevices using Helix. Now, this jailbreak will work from iOS 10 to 10.3.3 and also all 32-bit devices are supported. So if you have an iPhone 5 or iPhone 5C laying around, you, uh, it's your lucky day, you have the jailbreak. So yeah, without too much ado, let's go to this video. First of all, you need to go to the website helix.teamstar.net. That's letter E and not... not and that... Ah, uh, sorry. <laughs> That's number 3 and not letter E on the website. I'm going to put the link on the video descri description. So, f next one, you need to click this one to download the Helix IPA file. And I've also... Uh, for the sake of the video, I've downloaded the Helix one and the CG Impactor. So download both of them with the CG Impactor. Choose the version you have, either Mac, Windows, or Linux. I've already downloaded the CG Impactor. Now, after extract CG Impactor, and I've put it on a folder, um, you will going to see this one and also this one. But it's not included. I've just put it on the folder for uh, for organizing sake. So first things first, you need to run Impactor. Run it. then what you're going to do is oh before of that before that uh, you need to plug in your phone as you can see i plug my phone here and um you need to trust your device to the computer if for some reason if you click on trust on the phone and it's still not showing up you need you may need to open itunes then replug your device then trust your device to the computer again by clicking continue on itunes now if that's okay, and if you see the device of CJ Impactor, go ahead and drag the Helix application in here and put in your username and your password, and it will continue to put the app on the phone. So, I've already done that to save some time. Here is it. I'm going to show you right now the app on my f on the phone. So we're gonna. All right, here is the Helix app right now. But if you try to open it, it will have an error because you need to trust the profile. It's a developer profile. To do that, you need to go to the settings. There you go. And go to uh, settings uh, general and go to the profile and device management and tap your developer app, then click on trust and hit on trust again. Now, after that, you may now open CJ Impactor. I mean, Hel the Helix Jailbreak. Now, um, you can now also um, unplug the device if you want. I'm going to unplug the device first. There we go. So, here is it right now. And just press the button, Jailbreak. And it will jailbreak your iPhone. So, we're going to wait. I'm not going to pause this video so you can, uh, so you can see the step-by-step -step process. If you can see the storage almost full, that's okay, that's normal, and it's now running a jailbreak. It will also respring after that. And also, uh, warning though, notice, listen to this, you need to re-sign the app every 7 days. So, if for some reason the jailbreak uh, expires after 7 days, because the free developer account is only meant for 7 days, um, you just run uh, the, you just run CG Impactor, same thing. Drag the drag the IPA file, put in your iPhone, uh, I mean your iTunes email, then password, then you're done. All right. Oh, here is it right now. It's respringing the device. This one. So yeah. The good thing about this, this is already a permanent jailbreak because the last version of iOS on 32-bit devices is iOS 10 and the latest firmware is iOS 10.3.3 so th th this will be a permanent jailbreak I've just jailbroken my iPhone as you can see right now so it's still respringing and later on after we go to the home screen um, we're going to see Cydia installed <coughs> we 
it, uh, it's taking a while though but yeah all right to reset it's it, it already respring I'm going just to put my passcode there you go so I'm going to find the Sidia app and there you go Sidia has now been installed their device is already jailbroken this is uh this is a semi-tethered one so um, I'm going to post another video to if if your device has been restarted and the job and uh, and if you open CJ it fails just re jailbreak by opening the helix app there as you can see Cydia has now been installed your device is already jailbroken so yeah there you go as you can see here uh, iPhone 5.2 temperature pressure CJ 32 that is it so Make sure that you update all the necessary things in this one. So, yeah. Alright, so that's about it for the tutorial. And, yes, it's pretty simple and straightforward. And also, once again, don't forget to re sign the app after 7 days. Doing it, uh, if you didn't do it, the Helix app will not work if you try to re jailbreak it. Alright, so that's about it. I'm John Navarro and so yeah, peace and see you again on the next video. Bye bye.